As a lot of you talking online in our digital dive, the Minnesota Senate passed a bill to allow takeout alcohol sales at restaurants, but it doesn't include all alcoholic drinks. Now, it's no secret, people, they've been getting their drink on while they're in quarantine. In fact, liquor store sales are skyrocketing, up as high as 75% in March, which is according to the marketing firm Nielsen. And restaurants, they want a piece of that boozy pie, and the Senate thinks they should as well. Now, here's how it's all gonna work. Minnesota restaurants would be allowed to sell up to 72 ounces or six cans of beer, cider, or seltzer, or a bottle of wine to customers who order takeout. The drinks, they have to come in their original packaging and they can only be purchased with food, not sold separately. The caveat, right now the bill doesn't include liquor or businesses like bars, distilleries, and brew pubs that sell only alcohol. As much as we would like to expand it out there, this is as much as we could get done today. We don't want to let perfect get in the way of good. A bill's co-author Karen Housley says she is open to expanding the bill to include alcohol, but says sticking with beer and wine right now will help get it through the legislature faster. Now the House is going to vote on the bill later today, and Governor Walls has already said that he will sign it once it gets to his desk. And our Sunrisers had a lot to say about this story. Tani here thinks this is stupid. She says if I want a bottle of wine or beer, I can get it at the liquor store. She does, however, like the idea of those to-go kits. And Bridget wrote here, does this mean the stay-at-home order is going to be extended? By the time they pass the bill, May 4th restrictions should be lifted. And Bridget, that's a very good point. Uh, but if everything goes as planned, lawmakers are hoping to have the takeout alcohol bill ready by tonight. They're going to vote on it this morning. Yeah. If it passes, governor said he'd sign it. And so we'll see this in the works likely this weekend. Yeah, and, and I think this just gives those businesses another option. I don't know how many people are going to do that, but it is another option for right. them right now. Thanks, Alicia.